Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Antonia and Harley is with me today. If you don't follow me on Instagram or if you're new to this channel, then you might not be aware that Harley obviously is the hello Harley of this channel, but he had a bit of an accident and he's going through some stuff medically, so that's why he has all these shave marks. But just in case you're like wondering what happened to my baby, that's what happened to my baby. His hair will grow back. He was attached to a bunch of stuff and I've discussed it in another vlog because a lot of you guys do really like Harley and love Harley, obviously. Why wouldn't you? Um, but yeah, he feels okay today. So he's going to be in this video in the background of me filming. Right, boo-boo? I would bring a bed in for him so he's more comfortable, but he really just, he likes to be on the floor here. I already tried to bring a bed in, so. I took it out because he didn't like it so much. Anyways, today we are styling fall outfits with mini bags. I feel like mini bags is such a cute little trend and it's like been ongoing obviously. There's a ton of mini bags and designers that come out with mini bags. So I figured I would style my little mini bags with my fall outfits for you guys to see, especially now during our pandemic times obviously you might think you're carrying a lot more but I actually put a lot of stuff just in my car and if I'm going out obviously to do errands because you're not going anywhere right now um, I just like to take my little handbag with me and as long as it fits a hand sanitizer I'm pretty much good to go so let's get started here's my first outfit that I'm showing you guys I'm wearing the little moon rosella sweater this sweater is actually from last year fall winter collection so I don't think they actually have it but I will link some similar cardigans but the star of the show for this cardigan is that it has these like really beautiful pearl floral buttons it's very like grannyish style and then because I wanted to keep it casual because I'm just using this which is the main character Granger backpack it looks very reminiscent of the Prada nylon backpack it is just a nylon backpack and it opens up and it has a drawstring and it opens up and there's a pocket on the inside I've shown this before obviously you don't have to get exactly what I have but just for idea purposes because I'm not sure if the Aritzia actually has this if they do have it everything will obviously be linked in the description below and if I can't find something I'll find something similar to replace the item and then I also have this TNA life Almeida bra on I really like these bra tops because they are just so comfortable so I'm wearing it off the shoulder kind of slanted and baggy this isn't a size medium this isn't a size medium and then I have on my very furry because I was um laying with Harley. Uh, TNA Life Atmosphere. Atmosphere leggings are the high-rise version. They also have a mid-rise which is equator. I just prefer a high-rise and this is really casual and comfortable. I'm also wearing this in a medium and in terms of shoes I'd probably go with a pair of sneakers just to keep it super comfy and casual. If you want earlier today when I took Harley out for a walk I actually put on a Wilfred Free Ghana jacket. To complete the look, I just added on a Wilfred Free Ghana jacket. I have it on in a size extra small. This is in the birch color. It should be available. If not, it might be available for pre-order, but this is definitely a classic item that they have now. And you can still wear it off the shoulder so you get that kind of effect that it's sliding off because the Ghana jacket is so oversized. So this is the first look. Alright guys, I wanted to show you this second outfit because if you watch my channel regularly then you would notice that this dress is actually from the Spring 2020 collection and this is the Wilfred Only Slit Slip Dress. It's in this beautiful pistachio color. I think it is sold out now because obviously it was a seasonal piece. I wanted to show you that you can transition your spring items into your fall wardrobe. You can just add on a sweater like I did here. The new trend that I've seen a lot of people show is that they add a belt underneath and kind of scrunch it. This is a Montpellier. I do have a ton of sweaters that are cropped that would actually work better but because I don't want you guys to be going out to buy stuff just for the sake of 
buying stuff. I think utilize what you have in your wardrobe to create a fresher fall wardrobe and that way you're not always caught up in buying new items. Obviously, I'm like a fashion channel, so yeah, I do showcase a lot of haul stuff, but like for you guys and for myself, I do want to continue to wear pieces that I might have not necessarily been able to wear throughout spring and summer because there was just, and there still is, not that many places to go. So this is actually old. I bought this maybe three, four years ago. It's the Montpellier from Wilfred. I'm wearing an extra small. It is in the gray color. It comes back like every single year. I've done an Aritzia Basics on it. Super, super classic piece that you might have in your wardrobe already if you're an Aritzia avid shopper. Or if you don't shop at Aritzia often, you probably have a sweater that is about this like oversized look. If you have a belt, just add a belt on, then you can crop it. If you have a cropped sweater that works better with your slip dresses, then do that. If you don't have a slip dress, you can pair it with a slip skirt if you have so. Um, I don't have tights on underneath right now because obviously I'm filming indoors, but you could add tights. You could do black tights if you really wanted to. Because this is a like pistachio green color, I'd probably stick with a nude tight. And then for shoes, I'd probably do some combat boots, but I'm just too lazy to go grab them um, to show you guys the full effect, but I have done a look like this before in the past. My little star of the show is this little thing. This is the, and this is new actually. Um, I don't know why my hands look so red, but I promise you they're not. It might just be the coloring. I have no idea. But this is my new little Teddy Blake Ava 6 inch bag. It is so stinking cute. It doesn't come with the strap. The strap is from Next Fashion. I have affiliate links for these items in the description below. I also want to mention that this is not sponsored by anyone. I'm just showing you guys the items, but I feel like this little bag, by the way, if it's like a card holder, chapstick, and um, set hand sanitizer and you're basically good to go. It definitely doesn't fit a phone because here's my phone. I have a regular size iPhone, even a Max definitely won't fit in here. You guys can see it won't fit. So if you have a trench coat, I'll show you my outer layer that I would pair with this afterwards, but I'd probably just put my phone in my outer layer. I just think this is so stinking cute. I added the next fashion chain because I feel like it just elevates the bag a little bit more. It does come with a leather strap. I have here, it just comes with this strap as well. So here is the look with the Lawson trench coat from Babaton on. I'm wearing it in a size medium, but as you can see, it just looks so nice and put together. And you look a little bit more dressed up because these days, a trip to the grocery store is a little bit of a treat. I did also want to mention that Teddy Blake didn't sponsor this video. Nothing is sponsored in this video, um, but they did gift me this bag and they're doing a little bit of a Halloween sale between October 23rd to the 31st. I know this video is being placed in the middle of the sale, but you guys still have a little bit of time to shop if you are watching this. Um, live within the next few days so I wanted to mention that and they also do have sales all the time and then if you do miss the sale I do have a code it's TV Antonia 20 for $20 off I don't make any money off of that but if you do click my affiliate then obviously I will make money off of that but I want to be totally like transparent with you guys because y'all know I hate like the shady stuff being placed it's my third outfit coming at you it's my very festive but dressy outfit honestly if you were able to go into the office this would be such a festive Halloween outfit because look at my Super Saiyan pants so what I'm wearing is the Wilfred ballad top in a size medium this is such a cute top I bought this during the spring summer of 2020 so this should be still available and then I have on these pants, which is from last year. So it's from like the fall winter collection. Um, there are the Wilfred tie front pants in this beautiful silky material or like satin material. To be honest, they're not my favorite because they do wrinkle a lot once you start sitting down, but I really enjoy the bright orange color that they are. And they're just like a really nice fitting um, trouser and they're really nice and comfortable to wear and then I have over top a Cheryl blazer 
This one I bought when it was still like one, two, three sizing. So I'm wearing a size two, but I think the sizing now is small, medium, large. So if you are my size, I'd go with your true to size size. So probably a size medium, just because you want that like oversized fit. And then here's the mini bag that I'm carrying because I am keeping it pretty minimal here. Cause obviously the pants are pretty much the star of the show. I am just holding my Louis Vuitton, what is this called? Nano Nice, I believe. And I technically could put a strap onto it. Like I got these D rings from my friend Lauren, which if you don't follow her channel, then I will link her. But if you wanted to, you could put a strap onto it. Also, any neutral bag would work. So even this bag would work really well. I just wanted to show you like a variation um, of my mini bags so that way I can style it but the Teddy Blake obviously does work because it is neutral I just wouldn't go with the Granger backpack because you are so dressed up but this one is really cute and dainty as well and then because it doesn't have a strap technically you could definitely take this next fashion strap or any Vachetta strap that you have or any strap or any strap that hooks onto like say a d-ring or if you're a really really brave you can put them here as well um, but yeah, you can definitely hook on a strap and then wear this like that or like that and that would work as well. I just thought without all the dangly danglies, it makes the outfit a little bit cuter. So let's go through it again without the dangly danglies. So yeah, I just think it's really cute to have something handheld. And once again, here's the Teddy Blake one. Isn't that just so stinking cute, like this tiny thing. We are carrying a bag of this size. This does fit my iPhone, but it's just a pain for me to get in and out of with the iPhone in there. So it's really nice to have something with pockets and you can just throw your phone in there. But yeah, this definitely obviously carries a little bit more than this bag, hand sanitizer, lotion, chapstick, and your card holder would be really nice. But see, look, the Teddy Blake, the Louis Vuitton. What's your favorite? Tell me. And last but not least, we couldn't do a fall 2020 styling video without a pair of leather pants. Now, I've styled these leather pants. These, these are the Wilfred Rebel or Labyrinth pant. I think they renamed them to Rebel. Honestly, when I call out the names of the items, they change all the time, so forgive me. These pants are in the brown from last year, or I bought them early like winter 2020 I believe and I'm pretty sure they're back um, if not this color like a very similar brown color is in stock this is the TNA Carol sweater I really love this because the pants are kind of like dressy and then the sweater is kind of like it's just like a casual sweatshirt this is in the color mullen I'm wearing a size medium I did decide to put some jewelry on, but nothing too overly flashy. This is the Missouri Bold Link Chain because it's my favorite. It just goes a little bit, it just adds like a little bit of zhuzh to the outfit because the top is so plain. And then the bag of choice I have for this outfit is this beautiful color block bag from Atelier Park. Atelier Park is a Korean brand, hence the name Atelier Park, Park, you know? So uh, yeah, I will link this bag as well. I forget what the name of it is, but it is a color block. I think it's like the Atelier Park color block bag. And I just think it's really cool because it's this like super weird shape with this like one little dangly handle. It does come with a strap. You can put some, you can attach something to it. So you have a strap to make it a little bit more functional, but my phone does not fit in this once again. To carry this, phone's gotta go in the jacket or the pocket. And thank God, the Rebel Pants got pockets. So that's it. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. We really hope you enjoyed this little fall styling video with mini bags. 
sorry about my boozle. Anyways, if you guys would like to follow us on our daily life, feel free to follow us on Instagram at underscore hello Harley. And make sure to subscribe and we will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye!